Good morning, everybody. Today is a wonderful day for many reasons, but the first being that we are gonna do something great today. We will be running a hundred laps around the track. All right, first we need to lay down some ground rules. I have to get this done within the day. And that's gonna suck, but it's gotta happen. Uh, for those of you who don't know, 100 laps is around 25 miles, uh, and that's basically a marathon. So I'm basically just going to run a marathon. In fact, I might just run the extra four laps to get the 26 miles, just to say I did do the marathon. But this all has to be done within the day. I guess that's basically all the rules that we have. This 100 laps is not going to be easy. Believe me, I used to run cross country in high school, I think the most I had done at the time is probably 10 miles. So this is adding 15 just to that. That's why I'm giving me the entire day span. But the goal is to hopefully go about five miles an hour. I don't know if that's optimistic or not. I guess we'll find out uh, after it's all said and done. I'm actually gonna pick you guys up now, so. To fulfill this goal, I have a couple plans in play. First is that I'm gonna need a lot of help. Second, I have a lot of surprise Supplies. Try to say that five times fast. Surprise supplies. I have some supply surprise. I think I just said it backwards again. I have some stuff, okay? I have some stuff that I'm gonna take with me to make this also a little bit easier. I think now there's officially no time to waste, which means that we have to start with the most important part of running, and that's eating a healthy breakfast. So let's get some. Perfect. Now that the most important meal of the day is officially digested and completed. I think it is now time for the second most important part of running, stretching. Isn't she a beauty? All right, now it is time for the most important step of running. And the worst, it's the actual running part, but I guess we're gonna get that done. I guess there's no time like the present. Oh, hey, Kirby. So how you feeling? I'm hurting bad. About five and we're... You're a little over a mile in. Yep. Only 24 left. You're an idiot. Mm -hmm. But I think I might reward myself on every 10th lap I walk. Horns down, baby. Beat truck on. There's only two laps. The five hour challenge turns to the can he complete it challenge. <laughs> can we get it done in the day? Goals change very quickly, don't they? Yeah, because you did no training for this and you wanted to run a marathon. Yep. Stay hydrated. Feeling good. Yeah, Imagine. because you had no training. No training. None. I was prepared as anyone should be. Zero. So. I guess I'm gonna, I'm gonna go now. Run. That's a tip of the way. Not that. That's a good thing. It means we'll do that nine more times. Off he walks. The second tenth of his adventure. Is he an idiot? Yes. There's no question about that. Is he determined? Also yes. Connor. I made a dollar fifty in bingo clash. You made a dollar fifty? Yeah. Dude, why are you making money while I'm over here running? Because I'm smart and I use the app Bingo Clash that you can find on your iPhone. Not sponsored. And he's running. I think he's on twelve or thirteen now. Alright. So we are currently, I think, thirteen laps in. And I'm walking another. I think I've walked this will be the third one that I've walked. So I ran about two and a half. I will say that this does hurt. There's no proper training that I put in place before this. And I think it's killing me. Honestly though, morale is not too bad. Like thinking about it, 13 laps in. And I think we like just hit the hour mark, which is not what I wanted. I wanted to do 20 an hour. That was a little optimistic. It's fine. 
because we're gonna get it done today. I, I really do think we can. I guess this goes with anything. You just have to keep that positive mindset and keep moving forward. Because if you don't, your biggest enemy is really just yourself, let's be honest. But the human bodies can do pretty amazing things. And I hope that this video shows people that on this next lap, I'm about to pull out the secret weapon. Alrighty, secret weapon time. Boom, bandana corner. What's she gonna do now, 100 lap challenge? Nothing. Alrighty, that's three more done. That's 17 now. All right, I think I got a game plan moving forward. The move is about 14 laps in that first hour, right? So I think that I can bump that up to 15. Every lap, four minutes. That, I feel like, is very manageable. I'm gonna time this next lap walking, see what I get, and time the next lap running, see what I get, see how many off to run slash walk per set, and go from there. Look who's here. And he brought me ice. It's a good day. <laughs> For the running lap? I was two. Two minutes. I could literally run two and walk two if I wanted to, but I think, that was a lot of twos, but I think I'm gonna run two, walk one, and just keep going until we gotta stop for a lunch break. Plan is, time lapse, go. This is a testament to anything, my phone just overheated, which means that I don't know how much of the time lapse it got, but we are officially at 30 laps. Woo, almost a third of the way. Going strong. Oh, by the way, I think we just like, just hit the two hour mark, so. Hello friends, family, guardians, people that I don't even know. This is not very fun. It is a steamy degree. I don't know what it is right now. I am officially now shirtless because it is way too hot. My phone just came back on from overheating, if that tells you anything. The game plan is now, the constantly adapting game plan that I cannot stick to apparently, is to get to 50 and go on a lunch break. I think that's the move. Cheers. That's lap number 31. Lap number 32. 33. And that is 34. Woo! If you guys are wondering why I'm not out of breath, it's because I'm walking these ones. You want to know what's better than 34? 35. Oh, I still have so many more. Look who's back. It's Karen. Number, what's your favorite number? Oh yeah, 36. <laughs> Such a good number, like if you think about it. <sighs> All right, Connor, how are you feeling? I'm actually not feeling, well, okay, I feel awful, but I'm not feeling awful. Like here, morale is good, but otherwise, these are tired, so I've walked seven laps. And so we're on 37 now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's all right, sippy time. Ooh, that's number 38, baby. That is lap number 39. You know, it's, an, it's nice when you walk. Like, oh, let, let, me, let me change the camera. This is a nice walk. I'm not going to lie. Am I doing it fast? No. But I'm not in pain. And that is nice. On, I'm going to try to run lap 41. And if it goes well, then I'll run a lap, walk one, run a lap until I don't think I can. And then we'll get to 50. And I think Cam and I are gonna go eat Subway. Eat fresh, baby. I'm gonna try it. This is number 40. I'm running 41, baby. <sighs> when I get to that line, because I'm, I'm lazy. Kind of feeling it. You guys like the running view? Oh yeah. I'm swinging out fast. What's this move is run one, walk one. So we get to 50. That's 4-1 though. Let's go! Six more. He's excited for Subway. Dude, eat fresh. I'm going for that 12 inch. Of course you are. Remember, 43. And counting. Thank God it's counting. This may be the hardest thing I've ever done in my life. So why are you doing it? Because as John F. Kennedy said, we do not do things because they are easy, but because they are hard. God, that was an awful JFK impression. Oh, I'd say. Oh, it was uh, very awful. All right, here are another one. That was 44. He's an idiot. Officially. <laughs> Officially. Number 45. Done. Yeet. So this kid over there has ran almost 
11 miles at this point, if not a little more. He's struggling, hardcore. See, I'm the sensible one. I've walked a mile, maybe, a little over, I think, because I know my body's limits. But he is uh, determined, even without training. And that is why he's an idiot. Where are you at now, Connor? 45. Five more. Less time. Then we can have Subway. Eat fresh, baby! You already made that joke. Extra one. Four more. Oh. And that, folks, is a man who looks defeated. These things aren't working like they should. And it could be because I'm approaching the 12th mile. But I'm just going to assume it's laziness. So. What are the odds you run the last three laps? Zero. Run the last two. Walk this one, run the last two. Okay. He's dumb. He's an idiot. There are many words to describe, but he is, but lazy is not one of them. Uh, we'll check back in on him at lap 49 to 50. One more. We get a quick sippy. Oh, he finished strong with a nice run. All right, we got devil camcorder reaction here. He's motivated. I'll give him that. Honestly, it's starting to feel better running because I think I'm numb. Just everywhere. Why this is what his motivation is going to instead of stuff for college, a job, money. I do not like this anymore. Look at that. We gotta keep going. He's going. We're the last 100. He's about to hit the straightaway. He's hit it. Here's Canton. You can see him. He's just got the curve left before he's done. He's number 50, baby. And right there, as you see, boom, ouch. He's hit 50. Halfway done, how does it feel? Well, no stopping now, I guess. Except we're literally stopping to have lunch. Yeah, well, that's different. Subway, baby, it's time. Hey, Kimmy, how's the food? It's great. It's great. I'm about to get into mine. <laughs> this thing is bustin' bustin'. All done. Eat fresh. Third time I did that today. Yeah. Not sponsored. Not, but we would. Sure. Yeah. So boy. Eat fresh. Guess who's back at the track? It's me. I'm back at the track. Now that we're past 50, the threshold, we got a 50 more, which means that I got to do the same thing over again, like with 50 laps already on. So already just sucking not gonna lie but like the attitude all right we're not gonna let that get down the way i may say it sucks it does not mean i'm having an awful time i'm having a great time so i think the move here is to just to get back into it because i took like about an hour break to go eat walk five laps then maybe start doing a jug a lap walk a lap see how we feel from there oh it's getting it's getting too hot again cue the sexy music <laughs> You're making me want to vomit. Go. You disgust me. And women. Number 52. Electric boogaloo. 53. Really have to pee. Like seriously, kind of kind of have to pee. Lap 54. Don't want to do this anymore. Still have to pee. Would you look at that beautiful sight? It's a sprinkler. Spray me next. And as we can see, he has been blessed. Honestly, I think this is gonna help him a lot. Cool down more, and hopefully we'll get done sooner because it's taking forever. I wanna run through it so bad, so bad. Number 55. This is my eighth. His counts for me, I hope you know that. They no, don't actually. No, it doesn't. We wish. Lap number 56. Watch one extra. I think I should start running probably. Number 57. Sprinklers are back. You know, they actually did spread me one time and it felt really good. Now, I hope we don't consider this cheating. It's just a bath. That's all. A quick, quick bath. Oh, God, it's so cold. It feels so good, though. Guy mowing. Gotta love it. And Connor? It's going. I had a little fun with a sprinkler. Again, yeah. How was, uh, what lap you on? Uh, this is only 58. Nice. Number 59. Oh, fuck. 
Yeah. No. How are you feeling? 60% done. I feel a little soggy, and I don't know why. Okay. 61. Would you look at that? It's Kim. In sprinklers. Number 62. Cannon is not on the loo. All right, gotta get running. Oh gosh, I hate this. 63. I think it's time for a drink. Okay. 64. Yahoo! You see what I did there? Cause it, it's, yeah. Number 65. And we keep trucking. Number 66. Execute order 66. Hopefully they'll get me so I don't have to do this anymore. Number. Have you ever wanted to drink a sprinkler? Cause uh, I'm getting there. Number 68. Psych. I totally did two. We're on 69, baby. Let's freaking go. It's a great day. Number 70. That's 71. Almost three quarters. That is lap number 72 complete. And it's getting to me now. Number 73. Yes, I did go through the sprinkler. Lap 74 complete. And Cameron brought me another drink. He's so kind. Alrighty, game plan update. So I'm going to walk laps. I'm gonna walk lap 75. The game plan then is to take a little break. I don't know how long, but I don't want it to be long. I don't know, but I feel like my legs just need to sit and I can get a drink while I do that. Maybe even go to the bathroom because I still have to pee. Man, th this is tough, <laughs> but we're getting through it. Big buddy, man. Alrighty, lap number 75 completed. Kevin, water, just a little break. Bad hot. Bad way hot. Started walking again, and I want to do another time lapse, but I'm afraid my phone's gonna overheat again. Guess we'll see if I do it or not. Number 76 completed. Lap number 77 now completed. It's like we're, we're counting down. Remember when we counted up? Counting down. It's nice. Number 78, and, oh, maybe a drink. Yeah. Number 79. It's done. One more to 80. Just got done with number 80. I think now I'm gonna try for a time lapse. Let's see how we do. Well, folks, it seems a time lapse is just time lap. A time lapse is just not meant to be. You know, set it up and then the phone falls. You get one solid lap. In the end, I guess it didn't record it, but I'm now at 85, which means that we have 15 more. Plus four if we want to get 26 miles. And I have a Camden. 86. <sighs> kind of tired though. How much more you got? This is 87. You got it. Yes. We have now just passed 88. Keep going. This is number 89. Legs killing me. I still have stuff to eat. Just got done with number 90. 10 more. I'm gonna sit down and take a water break because I'm dying and we'll get back to it. This is the home stretch. Hello everyone. This is lab 91. My legs are so dead that I am going to sit down for a bit. I'll get back soon. 92. Okay. Watch out, Kevin! Oh no, you're gone. You're gone! Oh yeah. Feel the water. Here we see a rare Connor Doherty going to get absolutely destroyed by a sprinkler. Number 93, baby! There you have it. Alrighty, time to do, time to youth rejuvenated me. It's time to finish this. Number 94 done. And Camden's getting soaked. Nice. Number 95 in the book. Guys, I can't believe we only have five more. This is it. Well, really I have four more after this, but like my goal was 100 and then I'm gonna walk the other four. And there's a train. Choo choo. Number 96. Bagged. You know, if you flip the numbers of 96 around, you get 69. Number 97. Done. Literally. Three more. They're back. The sprinklers are back. Oh, shoot. Hey, guys. Anyway, the sprinklers came back right when I was passing. And boom, I'm soaked again. But it feels so good. Except on my toes. Okay? Those things are, like, gone. You know, have you ever ran in wet socks? Don't. That's all I gotta say. Did I say it was number 98? Well, that was number 98. Which means that we have two more. Kevin, that was number 99. Yeah, it was. You got one more. One more. And then four more, but one more. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the big number that everyone cares about is about to be crossed. And here he goes on the final but not final lap. Next to the dope sprinklers. 
the sprinklers are really gonna help him out, but they're all pointing away. Oh, what is he going to do? He's going to suffer. Here we go, that line, that beautiful line. And he's done it, folks. He's run 25 miles officially. Boom, that is 100 laps in 25 miles. Down, down! <laughs> oh my God. Okay, well, that was excessive, but yeah! Now I know that 100 should seem like the grand finale, but a marathon is actually 26 miles. So we're gonna do four more. And you guys wanna see my walking pace? You wanna see me do it again? It is a cape. Super gumma.